Boy, this is so graphic. <laughs> the place is just packed with bakery drivers. <laughs> I'd like to hear somebody clap. Somebody say, oh. <laughs> I'll give you my love Stop. each night and day. <laughs> He's just making this up as he goes. The all Marine Band. <laughs> Somebody, somebody, somebody. Somebody, play. please shoot him. Send her to me. Send her to me. Do in the butt. <laughs> I'll make her happy. Just wait and see. Anchor Burger, table three, pick I up. Prayed so hard. Well, Anchor got a big butt. To the heavens above. He looks like a young Cher. Huh. That I might find my first baseman's glove. Someone <laughs> to love. That's good. That was. <laughs> I'm just a lonely boy. <laughs> oh, yeah. Lonely yeah, what was I thinking? <laughs> oh, I'm all alone. I don't know why. With nothing Check that to out. Do. Wow, that's smooth. You wax that often? I've got everything. Except a career. You could think of. Yeah. But all I want. <laughs> Someone too long. The song is longer than Inagata DeVita. <laughs> teen song for Bangladesh. And so yet another season comes to an end for the Texaco Metropolitan Opera. Mr. Anka is a person. Hey, He's crazy. Hey, this is from Artie Johnson's point of view. He's just a lonely boy. Say, Leontine Price. Yeah, this is kind of good. Yeah, it's the platters. Love them. Is my salad up soon? Can I get my calamari, please? Dancing with you. Your warm tumbler of Jägermeister, ma'am, and your martini, sir. Did I tell you that sourdough was my idea? Yeah. <laughs> Boys, two men, two women. That too. Hey, <laughs> girl, pretty. <laughs> oh, what another drink? <coughs> now, do you got something against petting, Chicky Bird? I'm invoking Lander's Law. How do they support all these bands with just ten customers? They're so smooth, they're almost not singing. Oh, here comes the big move. You know, when they appeared on Sullivan, they had to be shot above the eyebrows <laughs> with the camera. They're almost as good as the Statler brothers. Yeah, you shoved the guy with loose hands over a cliff. Great come on line. Who told you that? I heard it. What you talking about, Willis? <laughs> Yes, she killed him. Oh, yes, she put him over a cliff. You know, some of the devs in Girls Town aren't exactly your pals, Silver Baby. They say you took the Mother Veronica route to keep out of the hotel with barred windows. I'm ODing on slang here. So skip it. So, you ever read any Balzac? Who were those witnesses? The dragons? Every one of them. Strictly U.S. Mint. Well, Zuli for them. Zuli? Now they're just improvising. Huh? What do you mean, true or not? Well, truth is a subjective phenomenon. It... I wish it were me. She killed him. Thank you. Great. Now out the back. Wait, they made up fast? Yeah. You know, even if you did shove that jerk off the cliff, they couldn't <laughs> pin anything on you. You didn't drive him there in your car. I didn't go there in his car either. You heard what the dragon said. Mm, you smell like rye. I mean, if the dragons lied for you, you're in the clear. Jack parks on a lonely road and practically attacks you. You had a right to defend yourself. Yes, but I didn't. Say, what are you, a cop? Uh-oh. Are you trying to trap me into something? Nothing like that. I'm a simple bakery driver, ma'am. Now I remember. Chip's father said he was going to convict me if he had to hire every detective in the state of California. Is it 
pretty smart. Oh, I'm dumb to fall for a phony delivery boy. Especially since you're 38. Whatever, private eye. Did Gardner hire you? Take it easy. We don't have to get mad at each other just because I have a job to do. Mm. Why don't you level with me? Maybe I can show you a way to clear yourself. I'm blasting out of here. Say, Mike, uh, hmm? Girls Town is run by an honor system? What's that? Oh, well, it's just some kind of Catholic thing. You know, it's all about guilt, original sin, rotten in hell for all eternity, oh. something along those lines, I think. Tom, Tom it is not. It's is about it? accountability. It's about taking responsibility for your own actions. Huh. And you know, as a matter of fact, I think the honor system might just be the thing we need right here on the good old satellite of love. Wow, the candy stash! Gee, Mike, you usually keep it locked up and only let us have one delicious candy bar a day. Yeah, mm. well, from now on, it'll be on the honor system. You still get to have one a day, but you have to police yourselves. Oh, gee, Mike, can honor really build character? Of course it can, Crow. I mean, ever since Demosthenes went walking the streets of ancient Greece, looking for one honorable man by lamplight, honor has been one of the most noble traits that we have. Like, history is filled with stories of, of men and women who would not let hardship stand in the way of their own deep personal sense of honor. Now, George Washington cutting down the cherry tree is a parable, perhaps, but it still it illustrates how, how honor contributes to the dignity and the stature of our nation's leaders. You, you ask if honor can build character? Uh -huh. Well, I say to you, my friend, without honor, would we even have character to build? Uh. Without honor, we are nothing more than wild animals. Uh. Mm. <coughs> <coughs> Mike, what was that you were saying about the honor system? I got kind of distracted. Oh, good one, Tom. We got a little... Ow! Hey, we got movies, son! No, no, no. <laughs> I can't walk. <laughs> Boy, that guy can really hey, put the groceries girl. away. I know. No self-control. Excuse me, Crow. Pardon hmm? me. Oh, like, oh hey. Oh, oh, sorry about the football. Oh, oh geez. Help me lift up in the plane. Oh. 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 The movie. Oh. Kind of full. Look, this is hell week for nuns. Toughest six weeks of your life, but then you're a nun. Yeah. I'm the outcast here. You dirty skags. Maybe someone ought to tell you how we operated Girls Town. We have a regular court. With regular Anybody payoffs. Anybody things tough for the rest of us? The court hears the charges and decides what to do. What's that got to do with me? Get in the witness here and find out. I think you're a zoo full of weirdies. But nobody's gonna drag me. Yeah, well, you're a cookie full of arsenic, and I'd like to take a bite out of you. Sit there. And sing Shock the Monkey. That's weird. Court's in session. I'm full. We've got charges <laughs> against Silver Morgan. What are they? This new chick thinks she's the smartest thing that ever walked through the door. Well, if she's so smart, how come she's in Girl's Town? <laughs> no, you know we got a pretty good thing going here. There's no walls around us. We're not caged up like a bunch of monkeys. And the sisters treat us real human. So what does this flea brain do? She sasses the sisters, smokes Dude. in the room, and last night she oh. out and goes night clubbing. She wiped it out her chin. <laughs> How long do you think they're going to let us stay here? We'll all be locked up in some stinking concentration camp with oh, bars on the doors geez. and grease in the hash just because this one fungus among us thinks she can get away with anything. So this is Schindler's List now? Mm. Do you deny any of this? Deny it? I didn't come to this jailhouse to be heard around by the keepers. I came for the food. You chicks have got any guts we can take over this place. We, we got, got guts. guts. Yes, yes, we, we do. do. We, we got, got guts. guts. How, How about, about you? you? Defense. Go bingle your bunk. Go crinkle your cronkle. Go finkle your fookle. Go pinkle your pongo. All in favor of a guilty bird.